there was a diary entry from 1990 in which he talks about Donald Trump is a symbol of the greed of the 1980s. So yeah. she had long-standing contempt for him. But he also savaged her son, Jeb, during the 2016 Republican primaries, and she didn't take that lightly either. Right, and she, she expressed alarm about him. Yeah. Uh, the, I, I think the best part, again, kind of classic uh, story in this book, is that she's given a clock, <laughs> a, a Trump administration <laughs> countdown clock, clock yeah. which she has with her in Kennebunkport, and she loves it so much that she brings it back to Houston. <laughs> And it was a treasured possession for her. When will this administration end? And she put it uh, in the most intimate place. She put it on the bedside table, both in Kenny Bugport and then in Houston. So I guess it would be the first thing she saw in the morning. Right. And the last thing she saw at night, it would say how many days and hours and minutes and left seconds in the Trump administration. left in the Trump administration. It's just amazing.